welcome you all back to my channel how are you guys doing today so if this is your first time of seeing my video please guys like i always said i do cooking video cleaning video i'm a lifestyle daily vlog okay please if you have not subscribed before you finish this video please smash the red button okay and give your girl a thumbs up I always share my video to your loved ones so today guys i'm going to be making some very delicious a goosey soup okay so if you have not seen me cook a goosey soup before i'm just going to cook a goosey soup now so guys let's go and cook cook with me if you are cooking a goosey soup pick up your pots and let's cook are you seeing the egusi now? This is the egusi. Are you seeing the way you just make it pop, 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 pop. So this is how we want it. Delicious well. So let's start. I'm going to be seasoning my meat now. I have uh, some rich, rich meat in my pot. Cow skin is there. I have beef and uh, shaki. Season it with some seasoning. You can season it with any seasoning of your choice. Have some sauce, some dried onions, thyme, curry to season your meat. And you cover it to bring some juicy water first. After that, add your onions. Your chopped onions we go and cover it again. Let it cook again. And this is my mackerel fish. I have one dried one, smoked one. And my catfish. This is catfish, dried catfish. I have my catfish there. I have my dried crayfish. I'm going to be putting some bitter leaf. Okay, so this is my melon. I'm going to be blending this a cucina what i'm going to be blending it like this not a dry type okay this is the way i want it today washing it before blending it with some tomato blend it with some tomato some scotch one scotch bonnet the ginger and garlic and bell pepper also blend everything have some onions blend everything together are you seeing it now blend it together so, this is my Morocco, which is stock fish. I'm going to be throwing it into my pot. And my dried fish, my cat dried fish. This is my cat dried fish. Very sweet, guys. I don't know if you have tried this before. It's very sweet. Look for it in that first stop. You can get it in that first stop. This is my macro fish. I'm going to be training my macro fish. Are you guys seeing, seeing it now? So watch this soup carefully, the way I'm going to make this small, delicious, a goosey soup. Okay? It's going to be very delicious the way it's looking already. Are you guys seeing it already? So. The meat is step aside now for me to start to fry the egusi. Okay? So, the oil, I don't want it to be too bleach. It's okay like this. Let's be showing chopped onions. Don't halal your oil, they should be too bleach. It's not good. We are not going to cook it down. I don't tell you. I don't tell you it's quite different from the red oil. So make it look like a red oil. So I'm putting in my crayfish now. Blended crayfish. I'm going to be adding my that I blend that I showed before fry them together stir it together let it stir for a while let it fry for a while put in your seasoning okay having your seasoning so I'm adding my chili pepper you know I like this chili pepper so much to make the food more perfect a little I've just put in my smoked aquat fish so as you can see everything I'm be putting the pepper have the fry for a while now 
for some time now so i'm going to be just watch this place carefully the way i'm going to be putting my egusi you don't have to pour your egusi directly to the pot okay just cut it like this chunks like this so that you can get a goosey the way we really need a goosey to, to be okay and you see to cover it let it fry after don't leave it keep on checking on it staring on it you'll be staring it don't just leave it to be there or, or else the down of the pot is going to get burned so we don't want that are you looking the way oh my god look at the way it is now are you seeing it are you not loving it now oh my god so i'm still going to leave it more you see it i always come to check on it for the down not to get burned the down of the pot oh i don't want it to get burned though i don't want that smell at all i wish everybody don't want that smell okay you see me mm. So I'm going to train in my bitter leaf. I'm using bitter leaf and uh, veget fresh vegetable leaf. So you have to put it at this stage now so that you have to go together with the goosey. This are what taught how to cook a goosey soup here. Okay, so this go with the goosey, the leaf we go with the goosey so that it's going to wrap the goosey, fold it together to really give you that beautiful a goosey dried one that will not bring out water when you are eating it you know some goosey when you are eating it they put it in the plate the goosey will go one side why the water will just go one side we don't want that nobody wants that this is the way we want it are you seeing are you not loving it already oh my god are you seeing it it's so yummy guys mm. It's so yummy, so yummy, so delicious. Are you seeing it now? You see, just follow every, every step here. You are going to love it. You are going to come for more when you try this. Okay? You are going to come for more. Just try this method. It's a very fast, easy recipe. Mm. Are you seeing it? So yummy. Please, if you have not subscribed, subscribe and let's build one great family okay always share my video guys always share my video always give me a thumbs up okay please you see me so great and so yummy it's so yummy guys this is how we want our goosey to be okay you seen you know loving it already Ooh. Come and eat with me, guys. So, thank you for watching. I will see you in my next video, guys. I'm expecting a girl. Okay, so thank you. Bye. Share my video. So, I'm having a guest. The food is done. I'm going to serve my guest now. You guys seen? It's from the DM. Oh, so you know.